Alright, if you're like me and you mess up on a regular basis here, uh, you're going to need to remove some solder from time to time. So if you kind of clip everything up as best you can, if you get a nice small pair of uh, cutters here, kind of trim all this little nonsense off of here as best you can. And once you get that about as clean as possible, go ahead and heat up your soldering iron. I like these little uh, butane numbers. No electricity, no cord to get wound up around things. I always seem to be knocking stuff off my table if I have a corded soldering iron. So that heats up. What you're going to need here is uh, some good old fashioned soldering wick. And this is, uh, from what I can tell, just a braided copper wire. And I think it just works basically off of uh, induction where you heat up this copper and it actually ends up drawing the solder out. into the wick itself. So you can see that wick starting to get dirty there. Picking up that solder right inside of it. Pretty much that's it. You just slowly work that hot wick over whatever you're trying to clean up and uh, it slowly draws it up inside of there. I know there's like some plungers and different suckers and whatnot um, that people like to use, but uh, seem to have pretty good luck with this wick stuff. <laughs>